How's it going? How you doing? Good, <laughs> Good to see, see you. you. All right. All right. So, what is this madness? What have you gotten involved you in? Know what, what is this I craziness? <laughs> I'm always getting into something stupid. You know what was what, <laughs> maybe one of my biggest laughs with you in it, and it probably would be completely unexpected. Mm -hmm. The socks. It was the socks with the gangster slippers, with like four guys with the same uniform on, and I know those socks with those slippers. With yeah. yeah. It's the details. See, you picked up on the details. Most people wait for the big laugh and the big in your face laugh, but I was like, oh my god, the socks, I know those guys. The, the shorts halfway down, yes. the dicky shorts. They would you... come to school that way. Yeah. You know, you, you know hang it out from. that way. You yes. know where you from. I honey. do know where I'm from. I, do. I have not forgotten. Don't let the Hollywood fool you. Amen. How much fun was this? It was come on, it's <laughs> It, it's one of those jobs where you say, man, I, I get paid to do this. Come on, I man. get to show up on set, say whatever I want to say within the script, and and act a fool. I could cartwheel in the scene if I want to. It's whatever. How and come Marley, you did it? Why didn't you just bust you up? You know what? I should have <laughs> hit a cartwheel. Part three, you'll, you'll see Ray Ray cartwheeling. There you go. So is that the kind of direction that um, uh, Marlon gives you? I'm sorry. Yeah. Is that what he says? Is he just like, have at it, go for Only it? Only because we've worked together so many times. He trusts my comedy. He mm -hmm. knows my rhythm. He knows exactly where I'm going to go. So all he needs to give me is a few keywords and say, this is what the scene is. This is what you want to accomplish in it. And I'm good. That's all I need. I'm, a, I'm an improv guy. That's what I do. That's what he does. And we just go hard. All right, so what was your favorite thing, scene? Every scene that I'm in, it's like, because each one has something different. Like in the first scene, the, the driving scene, I'm able to just sit up front, riff, and, and talk junk about the ghost of Essence who's sitting right behind me and then she chokes me out. Yes. And then the last scene, He's like, Abe, I want you to go through the whole house and just comment on every dead white person you see in here. And so it was like, a whole white family, honey? They done killed the whole family? God. So it's like, <laughs> I get to go through all these different ranges of emotions and jokes. So yeah. th there's no unfavorite scene. Do you believe in ghosts? Yeah. I think as human beings, we get arrogant as the human race to think that, for one, there's no other living creatures outside of Earth, mm -hmm. and then to think that once you die, that that's just all it is. So I feel like, yeah, absolutely there's ghosts. I don't know if they're all scary. Okay. I think sometimes they can be spirits. Sometimes they can, you know, depending on who that person was before they was dead, because some people are just assholes, and <laughs> some people are really nice. Okay. And I think ghosts are the same. <laughs> there's still asshole ghosts out there. And there's a lot in Hollywood about like haunted houses. I don't know why it is that there's such a concentration in this town. Have you ever lived in one, been been in one, or been on location and been in like a hotel that you felt like was haunted? Yeah, yeah, I lived with my ex girl, and uh, that was haunted. That was a, <laughs> that was a haunted experience. She's gonna get you for that. Hey, man, it is what it is. Okay. Uh, but no, I think Hollywood likes to they like to capitalize on people's fears. Mm -hmm. You know, that was that was that's the Hitchcock thing. You know what I mean? And that sells. People like to be afraid and and play into that that forbidden zone that twilight zone so you know why not make money off of it and finally are you writing any of your own projects we see you in a bunch of other people's projects and secondly serious at all do you want to do any maybe you know dramatic yes acting? yes and yes okay i've been a writing beast over the last year i've written like two pilots i wrote a movie that me and russell simmons are producing and a pilot that i'm producing with him too okay so yeah it's it's a, a lot of things and and absolutely i'll be doing some dramatic roles too. well i look forward to seeing you absolutely thank, thank you, you so much thank for you this. as always <laughs>